Americans say the discovery of chemical warheads in Iraq is troubling and serious. The chief UN weapons inspector arrives in Britain for talks with Tony Blair. Manchester murder, a North African man appears in court charged with killing DC Stephen Oak. Sweetening the pill, how supermarkets could soon be giving out more prescriptions. A £50 million lottery payout plans for a once a year super prize. Good evening. Troubling and serious. That's how America has described the find of 11 empty chemical warheads in Iraq. The White House claims the shells do not appear in the dossier given by Iraq to the United Nations. Now, the time is a quarter past six. In a few moments, saving the sharks, why the ocean's top predators face extinction. And Chris is here with all the sport. Yes, Australia and Yorkshire's Darren Lehman's cricketing future is in the balance after making racist remarks. Now, one of the oldest and most feared predators on the planet is in danger of disappearing from the seas. Scientists say some species of shark... Including... And a reminder of tonight's main news again. The Americans say the discovery of chemical warheads in Iraq is troubling and serious. The chief UN weapons inspector, Hans Blix, has arrived in Britain and held talks with Tony Blair. We'll bring you the latest on those stories just before 7 o'clock, so stay with us. Before that, it's time to join the BBC's news teams throughout the United Kingdom.